Alicia Soiko down, centre mid, number eight. I wouldn't say there's a specific time where I started playing, I've just always played in the back garden with my dad or in the playground with the boys. I joined a proper team when I was about seven or eight and just kind of went from there really. Um, earliest memory would be either playing with my dad in the field um, right near where we used to live or playing in the playground with all the boys at break and lunchtime. Um, it was like coming home really. Um, I used to play uh, when I was a lot younger, so I think I joined the Centre of Excellence when I was 10 or 11 and left when I was 14, so signing again um, a couple of seasons ago, it was just, yeah, coming back home really. Um, so my best memory would definitely be the Watford game that we played against Portsmouth or the one just before Christmas where we played against Plymouth. Um, both games really tight, we both won both actually 5-4. Um, <laughs> But the one before Christmas really sticks out in my mind because it meant that we went into that break uh, top of the league, which was our aim. So going into that um, little break and the Christmas and the New Year top of the league was was really just what we'd aimed for and what we'd worked hard for. Um, when I started playing, um, there weren't like too many major role models that you knew about and like were really uh, like present in social media. So I think a lot of my influence growing up and what I saw, like I, I wanted to be a lot like the men and that professionalism and especially in the women's game it was all kind of semi-pro so that's what it was like sort of growing up and those are my influences and my role models but now you look at the top league and they're all professional they're all really in the limelight everything uh, it's just out there and that's what the young kids now get to see like growing up that you can make a career out of football you can be professional you can make it your everyday job so that's a really positive change and that will just keep changing and, and growing in the future as well. Um, look forward to winning the league, obviously. Um, uh, obviously that's our aim, it was our aim at the start of the season. Um, it will continue to be our aim, we've worked really hard, um, we continue working really hard, so that promotion, that top, top of the league spot is our goal, so that's the only thing I'm looking forward to really. Click here for more videos.